Blackmer v. United States, 1932. In the early 1920s, the Teapot Dome scandal rocked the country. It concerned a bribery scandal involving the administration of President Warren G. Harding. Harry Blackmer was a citizen of the United States living in Paris, France. He was subpoenaed twice by the Supreme Court of the District of Columbia to be a witness at a criminal trial involving the scandal. The subpoenas were delivered by a United States diplomat in Paris. This was possible due to a 1926 federal law allowing subpoenas to be delivered to American citizens overseas. Blackmer was fined $60,000 for failing to appear in both trials, with his property to be seized to pay for the fine and court costs. Blackmer appealed the fine on the grounds that the 1926 federal law violated the Due Process Clause of the Fifth Amendment to the Constitution. The case went all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In an eight-to-nothing decision, the Supreme Court ruled that the federal law allowing for the issuance of a subpoena to a citizen overseas was not a violation of the Constitution. The court ruled that sovereign countries have the power to compel their citizens to return to their home country when it is in the public interest. It is the duty of citizens, no matter where they are in the world, to appear in court when subpoenaed.